What's the name? Swan. Emma Swan. Hmm. Emma. What a lovely name. Thanks. Uh, scarf and cane go in the basket. What? Scarf and cane go in the basket. I can't. You have to. It ain't rocket science, buddy. You ever been on a plane before? Have you ever been impaled upon a cane no. before? My father's a little nervous. We're headed to a family reunion. Sorry. Father? And right now, we are your best hope. Time's come for you to start trusting someone. And if I were you, I'd start with family. You're Henry's grandfather. We're family now. And I'm gonna save you. No, I feel sorry I should. Emma, how lovely to see you. I'm flattered you take time off your busy schedule for me. What can I do for you, Sheriff? If I let this go, I could forget who I am. I'm not gonna let that happen. What's your price? Forgiveness. How about tolerance? Well, that's a start. You're a brave woman, Emma Swan. Well, well. Must be my lucky day. Care for a cup, Miss Swan? You enjoy your stay. Emma. Somehow I suspect there is more to you than a simple pawnbroker. You really want to start that fight? I like you, Miss Swan. You're not afraid of me. That's either cocky or presumptuous. Either way, I'd rather have you on my side. I think the real reason you lied is to protect yourself. What's that supposed to mean? From getting hurt again. It's not happening. You want a second chance for that, man? What makes you think that? The look in your face. You have no idea. What, what are we talking about? What you respect, but it's her son. And it has to be her. She's the product of the magic. She must be the one to find it. I can do it. Do you think that we should... If we were welcome, I feel confident an invitation would have been extended. It's a sad truth that the people closest to us are the ones capable of causing us the most pain. That's our common ground, Miss Swan. That's why lying to him just caught up with me. Uh, give me time, he'll forgive you. Is that you projecting your own hopes? You told me you could fix this. That's why I came to you. So that you could make sure Regina didn't win. Well, she hasn't yet. Well, she's going to. And now my friend is going to pay for me trusting you. Look, Sheriff, I know this is emotional. But it's also not over. You must have faith. There's still time. Time for what? For me to work a little magic. Look who's suddenly become a woman of faith. Why are you here, Miss Swan, to spin conspiracy theories? I need help. From me. Every time I've gone up against Regina, I've lost. Except for once, when I became sheriff, when you helped. As I recall, you don't exactly approve of my methods. I approve of your results. I need you to speak to me. Try and convince them to come back to Storybrooke with us. I recall there was only one favor I owed you, and I think I'm paid up. This isn't about me anymore. You'll do it for Henry. How do you figure that? Well, because if you don't, you're going to wake up one morning and discover he's hopped in a bus back to New York. He ran away to Boston to be with you. He'll do the same thing for his father. Because the sheriff had me arrested for nearly beating a man to death, and I managed to persuade the judge to drop the charge. But asserting your influence isn't what's needed here. We need to find the truth. Exerting influence may be exactly what's needed here. What's needed here is for me to do my job. Well, no one's stopping you. I'm only here to help. Enough! I need to save my friend. And you're willing to go as far as it takes? Farther.